yo 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 Myanmar with a shout out and it's very very humid. Let's watch some uh goals of the week. Fixture congestion means we've only had two awards. Well, DCL over the top. Ronnie. Really? Two game weeks of actions. Supper Rooney. Wow. When did Whammer become cool? Oh, Ronaldo and Messi. Both in the top three. Gobshite League living up to the best of the best status here. Both being set up by middling Premier League strikers. <laughs> Born cool mate. Well, that sure showed me. Santa Maria Jao Felix. Oh, oh. Okay, that's a goal of the week. Oh. That would have made a wonderful noise off the crossbar, that one. Oh, Marouane Fellaini. They may have lost 4-1, but the one was a cracker. Marouane Fellaini tucks it away. Oh. Obligatory Luis Suarez free kick. The, the gobshite king of set pieces. And another direct free kick. Look at this away kit, it's beautiful. Which is away kit, man. Oh, that one was lovely. That one was lovely. And that brings us wonderfully to kicker. Oh, I thought I was at the right spot. Had some buttons to press. Here we go. Both teams in away kits. A blue and purple striped number for Tiki Takatoa. Oh, Bruno looking over the top. Oh, the weatherman. Calmly back to Joblack. And Dave's away kit was described as... Uh, the sort of poo you need to see a doctor about. Something like that, wouldn't it, George? I forget the exact phrasing. Oh, what a ball! Oh! Gigi's tried to be cheeky. And all he's done is hit the woodwork. Consult a medical professional, yeah. yeah. So tough to say whose is the better away kit. Fine cut to back. Muriel cannot find Big Rom. Harland here. Can he go full 1v7? Oh my lord! Jesus Christ, Darling Harland. Pretty good. <laughs> uh, I did not. No, no, I did not. That's something that uh probably I should I I'd completely forgotten about, so remind me tomorrow at like ten two. Oh, Big Rob hits the post. Jevons, mm, just about away. Oh, Harland with a free header. Dybala. Off the woodwork. Uh...
Dabala's not a BBC legend. Gareth Bale, Jenny Dakenham, James Milner are. Oh. But not Dabala. <laughs> I love that Jenny is. <laughs> Dave still Jenny from the block. Oh, what a save! What a save that is from Mendy. Hi Vince. Oh, Juan. Ball in. Big Rom. Oh, Big Rom loses out to the weatherman. Oh, Mason Mount. Chance for BBC. What was Mason Mount trying to do there? It was a really good opportunity for the BBC on the counter. They had numbers. And then Mason Mount just decided to pass it to Ruben Diaz. Big Rom wins the head of that time. High and wide. Ooh. Job back forces the s makes the save. He didn't force the save. Quadrado forced the save. Oh, Black holds on. A Tiki Taka Toa going to drop their first points of the year to the BBC. Could be a third draw of the year for the BBC this. In just their fifth game. Oh, Mason Greenwood. He scored late winners multiple times this season. All eyes on Greenwood. Eyeing up a third late winner. Here he is. Greenwood. Good ball. Quadrado cuts it back. Oh, good interception there for the BBC defence. Chance for them on the counter. Di Maria over the top. Cavani. Oh my lord. This being ruled offside is completely unfair. I don't care how offside he is. If you're going to score from 30 yards, it doesn't matter if you're offside. But like, yes, he's offside, but does it matter? Look at where he is when he shoots. It's not like he's gained an advantage. Fair enough if he'd ran into the box. Like whether there was a defender behind him or not wasn't didn't didn't affect that. Oh, Big Rom's diving. Big Rom with the dive. Tiki Takatoa getting Look, Lucky Laka lower back at back at it again. Oh I thought Black had saved it. I thought he'd saved it. But it squeaks through. Big Rom gets his sixth of the year. Big, big season for him. If your goalkeeper is relying on a defender to stop an effort from 30 yards, your goalkeeper's fucked up. That's not the defender's job to get in the way of a shot from there. The keeper should have that comfortably. Lucky Laka lower strike again. Speaking of lucky teams, here come the Lucky Llamas. Continuing their lucky streak by getting to play the Elves on an odd week. Look forward to the Elves looking like utter trash today because... Yeah, here we go. Grealish has scored from... Inst how, how has Grealish got this volley? Three elves around him. I 
I love how consistently inconsistent the elves have been this year. But that makes no sense, Mike, because how often do you see players shooting from 30 yards and it going in, whether there's a defender there anyway? Removing the defenders is, is only going to make the goalkeeper's job easier because they, all they're going to be doing is potentially blocking his line of sight if they don't actually stop it. Uh, I did not, Whammer. Remind me tomorrow, just before the stream. Well, I mean, like 10-2 or something. Because I did not today. Oh, Benzema! Great work from Bezwar. Fakir looking for hummus. As will I. Pogba. Oh! Oh! What, is, what are the lava's doing? There was just no need for this. He just kicked his. He just kicked his back leg. You know, like when your friend's walking in front of you and you kick his back leg to try and trip him up. That's what the lava's have done here. The ball's going behind. Yeah, no, well, I mean, if the wall successfully does its job, it blocks the shot, right? That's the aim. But if they don't block it, then them being, then them not being there would be easier, right? Because the keeper would have more vision of it. So, it's only easier for the keeper if they fail to do the, their actual job. Their job isn't to get in, it's to actually prevent the ball reaching the goalkeeper. No, Mendy definitely dived down to his left. You you don't you don't not try and still dive down to your left. Oh my god. Lucky Llamas getting away with one there. Okay. Oh, can't get it past Fofana. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah. Exactly, their aim is to block the ball, right? But if they don't block the ball, then they have, in, in effect, just made the keeper's job harder. Because, yeah, if the keeper is only responsible for half the goal, but then the attacker gets it around the wall into the other half, the keeper's job is harder. And he would be... Oh, my Lord! What was that? That's like even game week level of elves play this. Holy shit. Last season, the dresser guy was the king of the Bosch. This time, he only gets the assist. Lama's lucky to escape with a point here, in what should have been an easy game. Odd game week elves. The Lamas still undefeated, I guess, but uh, not looked at all convincing the last few weeks. Lucky to get a point this week. Drew with 10-man surreal last week. Mo Salah on the counter. Pellegrini and Carrasco. Good stuff this. Oh, cuts it back across. Mo Salah on the volley. Blocked by the defender.
the match progress bar. What, this little pink thing? Why? Oh! Chiesa goes close. Ah, oh, I forgot! The fast loan or away kit is brilliant. I love the fast loan or away kit. Ah. Oh. Aiming for Gabagol at the back post there. So I was looking to double their points tally. It looks like Barcelona have realised all their players are old and they're falling off a cliff already. They've just not been the same team now that they were in the first three weeks. Oh wait, the Elves missed a penalty. I completely missed that. Too busy arguing about goalkeepers. Man, the Lamas are lucky. Why did no one mention that was a penalty? Oh, it's real in there, away kit. Ah, oh, yeah. I remember them winning the penalty. You're right. I do remember that. I just completely forgot it was happening as a penalty, and then... Mate. I am real dumb. <laughs> was it saved or wide? Or what? Royce? Oh, no. Surreal. <laughs> A tidy finish from Marco Royce, but uh, Surreal. Gotta be asking questions of uh, how that's happened. Oh, Alonso wins it. Oh, lovely football here. Thomas Mueller, great finish across the keeper. Fraser Foster can't get down. He's too tall to get down and reach it. Okay, slab it. Marauding up the pitch, as he's wont to do as a wide centre back. What a ball! Michael Royce first time. Okay, it's back in. Mueller lays it off. Good to one. Good save from Fraser Foster. Oh, Marco Royce. Oh my lord. Surreal down to 10 again. Uh, unlike their last 10 man game, I don't know if they'll be uh, coming away with a draw in this one. Losios seem slightly more competent than the Llamas. Uh, I do. I know the concept yet. Did did Los Eos have a bad week game last week? Ah, yeah, you're right. That that is. Oh my God, Mueller! 
That was really not good there. That is certainly the vibe they're giving off. Why is Suarez not on free kick duty? Suarez schools that, just saying. I like to think that what they're actually doing is stoking the flames of the llamas and surreal rivalry even more by doing getting that point off the llamas with 10 men and then the following game going, look how shit we are and you still couldn't beat us. You don't give a player a free kick because he's on a hat trick in the 25th minute or whatever it was. Also, he's not on a hat trick, is he? Oh, he is on a hat trick. That doesn't seem like a reason. How good is he at free kick? 16. See, Suarez is back on him. Maybe they're just like the same and they just take it in turns. Gundogan looking for Mueller, brings it down, cut it back, Royce fails to acquire his hat trick. No, Suarez is just better. Unsure why Royce took that free kick. Okay, Royce. Marcus Alonso. Suarez finally gets himself on the score sheet. Kolarov with the missed header. Sad times. Love Kolarov. Royce with the free kick. Okay. Oh, what a ball! Suarez, you got to score those. Okay, he's offside. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter that he failed to score. Pavar. Looking for Raul Jimenez. This, I imagine. I don't think, I think this is the biggest loss of the year. Right? We've not had many absolute thump. What was that? Mate, so what's Surreal doing? Roy says the keeper completely the wrong way. Gets himself a hat trick. Lovely jubbly. We've not had many hat tricks this year, have we? This is only what the second? Richan Mueller. Oh. Oh, and I. Roll or six nil. What a thumping! It's almost like the pensioners. This. Asensio, good turn, roll, nothing there. Mueller, edge of the box, puts it wide. Is Mueller just playing centre mid? Love that. 6-0 up, 
And Jimenez is picking the ball up and placing it down for the goal kick. He wants more. <laughs> None of this time wasting malarkey. Half man still in search of their first point of the season. Lewandowski. We'll be hoping to grab a goal to keep pace with Lukaku. Memphis on the counter. Fernandinho just bulldozes him. No booking though. Oh dear. Danilo and Torres tackling each other. Half man. Unable to capitalise. Picks up Luke Shaw. Inzinha cuts inside. Goes wide to Danilo. Ball back in. Inzinha at the back post on the volley. But is he offside? Wonderful ball. Maybe just a slightly... Oh no, it stands. Lovely goal this. Takes a touch, lovely ball, and Zinja on the volley. Half man en route to a fifth consecutive loss. Not ideal. Okay, half man, only one behind, got to find a way into this and get their first point of the year, Memphis, it's a good run, Tadic goes down, taking a look at it, I think we all want half man to be given this, give them a chance, who's the penalty taker going to be, Tadic, Memphis? Neither of them strike me as great penalty takers. Ah, it doesn't matter. It's not given anyway. Ref says, good tackle. Vardy, yeah. Oh, Vardy brings it down. Jamie Vardy's having a party. Wouldn't you like to go? Lovely ball this from Marusic. First time as well. Vardy oh, takes a touch, brings it down. Slots it past to Stegen. Love that. Oh, it's Ramos versus... It's actual Sergio Ramos. He's probably the penalty taker. No? Oh... The referee hates half man. They say no to their pen, but they give one to half man. Lewandowski converts. Levels it up in the golden boot race with Big Rom. I wonder who the penalty taker would be between Ramos and Vardy. Oh, Inzinha. Good ball in. Big Bob. The keeper just seemed to switch off. The keeper just wasn't paying attention. And just like that, half man looks set for their third. No, for their fifth consecutive loss. So Ramos is. 18 at penalties. Vardy is 17. So yeah, it would be Ramos. Oh, 
build but not penalty taker it seems. Oh, Soyan Chu makes it four. What a header this is. The keeper may have been at fault for number three, but not much you can do about this one. You don't save those. Otamendi not having the best day. Oh, Damian! Love that guy. Sad to not have him at the Ducks this year. Fernandinho, Jorginho, Matteo Damian. Oh, I thought Damian was going to put his foot through that then. Go on, bosh it! Damian. Oh, looks for Big Bob. That's a hat trick? Yeah. Big Bob looking very good this year. Not something you can say about half men. <laughs> they are gonna struggle. By the looks of things. Oh. No wall in there. Awake it. Oh, Skarinia throws Correa to the ground. Skarinia's going to be on Santa's naughty list with challenges like that. Harry Kane. Oh, just about. Just about converts. So, when I saw this away kit for Norwell, I was like, it's festive, it's red and green. But it also just looks like it should be a Portugal kit. Right? Can't decide whether it's more festive or Portugal. Oh, Luka Jovic! I don't think this is offside. Yeah, this, this definitely is also, No, it's fine. Goal's clearly good. Luka Jovic having himself a year. Look at this. What was that? Goal number five? Four. Four in four. Who needs Duvan Zapata when you've got Luka Jovic, eh? Rodri's header goes close. SMS. Oh! Finds Lozano. Kind of at the back post. Yeah, the admin derby. Not if you draw. Goes and heads away. SMS. Got any more messages in his pouch? Skarinia, what a ball! Luka Jovic on the volley. A third tight offside call. The first two were given. The third... Also given! <laughs> Pigs playing right on the edge. 
<laughs> Love it, yeah. Harry Kane and Erickson, Frankie. Closes and Felix. Frankincense de Jong, I remember. Correa. Vinny and Musiala. Blind, Rodri. Daily blend. Maziala. Oh, somehow gets that ball to Vinny. Blend. Rodri cuts it back. Vinny. This is lovely football. That. That was some lovely football. Great goal. Merry Christmas to the pigs. No turkey this year. Just ham. I guess that don't work. I guess that would need to. That would work better if the pigs were losing, wouldn't it? Yeah, it probably works better if the pigs lo would have lost this. The ham joke. No ham this Christmas. Well, congrats to the pigs. Looked very good. Pythons versus Menace. Two of the top four squaring off. Reese James and Sancho. Oh, lovely touch. Ansu Fatty brings it down, cuts it back. Koke. Oh, lovely football. But Fatty can only find the post. Mkhitaryan finds top 10. Top 10's been real good this year. Papu Gomez. And Paredes. Okay, patient here from the menace. The fridge. Brozovic. Dembele. Top 10. He's got no one in support. He's had to go backwards. Great bit of possession here. Top 10. Doesn't miss those. What a goal. This entire passage of play was so nice. First round pick, Brozovic. Yeah, silly me. Got to give this full title. Absolutely carved the pythons up there. Feeling a bit better about not being able to get anything done against the menace. If they're doing this to the pythons. Oh, Parades with another free kick. His second goal of the season. His second from a direct free kick. Uh, Yankee Hotel Foxtrot. So, you mean when you've played against good teams, you've looked awful. That's not great. I 
How do I say that guy's name? Mike Minyan? Minyan? Minya? James Justin and Papu. Papu? Top 10! Makes it 3. Oh boy. Mignon. Ah. Mignon. Thanks, George. To be fair, you it's okay to be struggling a little bit now because what you really, really need to avoid is being top at, at after seven weeks. Because as we all know, the, the top at, at game week seven is a curse. I'm excited for um, Tiki Takatoa to return to their former glories of battering everyone in the first month or so and then shitting the bed. You just say your nan. Oh, penalty to the Pythons. Martial going to continue to pad his stats. No, nope. Martinez saves another penalty. Holy shit! Martinez is real good at saving penalties, right? Oh, Brozovic. Martial's clever though. He misses this penalty where it has no impact on the game. He's gene. He's clever. He's like, well, I have to miss about half of them, so I might as well miss this one. Yeah. Oh, Joe's Justin nips in, steals it, and the whistle's. Uh, <laughs> uh, penalties. Ah, so he saved two out of three penalties now. Absolute monster. <gasps> it's the Ducks versus the SS. Amondi's back. Love that. Big Maxi. Come on. Aubameyang. Okay, JWP. We go again. Hacker me. Messi, ball in. Oh, Aubameyang. It takes two attempts. But he gets it in the back of the net. Great start here for the Ducks. Things we love to see. Oh, JJ, ball in. I'm one day on Ward Prowse. Oh, Bamiang finds Big Maxi. Cuts it back, Bamiang. No, no. Davies? Oh, cracking effort that. We've looked good in the first 11 minutes. Can we keep it up for the remaining? Zinchenko, set piece specialist. Unable to convert. Oh my lord. Ducks into the top three. Love that the llamas continue to disappoint, but it continues to steadily climb the table. Acherby and Amondi. Hakami, Amondi, Acherby. Well, three of my back four all have names ending in I. That's exciting, isn't it? Oh, 
Will Zinchenko. Ball in. Oh, my Lord. David De Gea. Incredible instinct save. Yeah, he doesn't get to do it at Man City because he's not Kevin De Bruyne. Right? Like, but Oh, my Lord, Mbappe. Oh dear, the ducks, eh? We looked so good. And then we just stopped looking good. JWP, come on. Oh, looks right. Oh, Messi! Lays off, Luis Alberto! Oh my god, Alberto! <sighs> Gotta at least get that on target, buddy. Come on. If you want to come back for season 12. Gonna need to do better than that. Oh, long ball forward, just punting it up. Ibanez collects though. Well, that was big Maxi. St. Max. Oh, Bamiang. Referee! Referee! Have a word with yourself. That was a wonderful tackle. Thank you, Ref. Uh, where's Zinchenko? Okay, Zinchenko is. Oh, I didn't get to see. Did I lost it? Zinchenko is thirteen. So probably not what you want from your best free kick taker at this level. Wait, why did Kieran Trippier not take it? He's he's better. Odegaard, he should be good at him. 15. Yeah, why did Zinchenko take it? They have a bunch of people that are better than Zinchenko. Fuck off, referee! What What is this referee doing? He's just adamant. The SS are getting a penalty here. Piss off, ref! Oh my god, Aspas is 17! Why did he not take it? Aspas may not have been on the pitch, to be fair. Well, we've come up against... Well, some pundits are calling the fifth best team in the league. Can't be too surprised when they when they pull it out late like this. God, Luis. Well, Zinchenko ended up shooting anyway, right? So. <laughs> oh, God. God. Ashley Young. Oh, God. Try again. Go on, Ashley. Bosh Ward Bosh. Messi. Oh, Bamiyang. <laughs> Why is that Bamiyang so shit? Bosh Ward Bosh. Oh, he's. Why have we. <laughs> That free kick routine. Why have we tried to give Asabi a volley? Oh, why is no one getting to the rebound? What are my team doing? Man. I feel like we probably could have at least drawn this. Maybe we should have even won it. Beginning to think Aubameyang was a mistake. Oh well. These things happen. Oh, two teams both in their away kits.
Throwing it out there, these two away kits have more in common than the two home kits. Just me? <laughs> Hacker me. Absolute shit show. Not even the best player named Atcraft this season. That's not very nice, is it, Mike? Oh, De Bruyne can't quite get it over the top to Victor. I might have to accidentally forget to do Tiki Taka Toa's full heal. See how you like them apples. Oh, this is lovely stuff from Wedge. Can't wait to see how they screw it up. Kevin De Bruyne. What's it say about it? Listen. Oh, Kulosevsky. Saul. Oof. That doesn't seem entirely fair. But I, I have won the league, so I'll take it. Because I am better than most of you. Oh, Kevin De Bruyne. It, it, what bugs me, though, is I've won the league, but I've not won the cup. And I care far more about the cup than the league. Losing two cup finals. Very annoying. Very annoying. Oh, Corona? The cup is definitely the better thing to win, mate. I agree. I like that even when my team is shit, we generally do reasonably well in the cup. Oh, Simon. Oh, my lord. How did you not even hit the target? <laughs> George, the only multi-trophy winner without a cup. I like that we've got two teams. So, like, one team with two leagues, no cups, George. And one team with two cups, no leagues, the Manx. Two teams with two leagues and a cup. We yet to get a two cups and a league though. I guess until the end of this year after Mitch does the double. Then we'll have a two cups and a league. Is Vince the only team on exactly one and one at the minute? Yeah. Now, now, Jack. Now, now. Saul playing left wing. A far cry from the days when he'd have to play at centre back. <laughs> Zielinski! Oh, what a strike. Wedge, they've looked good all day, and they've managed to shit the bed. Classic. 
Yeah, they won the league in season five, and then won the double two se two years later. This is the year. We all we all stopped telling the dogs that they were going to be the best on paper, and they're going to be the best in the game instead. Our headliner, our main event, the reigning champions, the Weasels, against Victor Valdez is pressing people, Sans Boshomero. And Herrera plays it through. Ooh. Rudy G. Ball in. Ronnie. Over. This is going to be a draw. Do you reckon? I reckon 3 1 Weasels. Chiro, Radebi, Barella. And then some injury time consolation goal f for Kovacic. Ike. Where's offside? He's offside apparently. 10 0 Manchester. Oh, what was that? Roddy. Oh my god, Roddy. How have you. How have you fucked that up so bad? Tellers. Oh, too much bend, too much bend. <laughs> oh boy. Zuma. Bench. Martin Darun. Delict. Not the best pass. Ronnie. Hackers and Raul Garcia. Is he the man they want in this position? Fake Ramos and Simo Rochalco. This is nice football here from Manchester. Oh, what a ball. Raul Garcia. Not the man you want in that position. Although, given what we've seen from Ronaldo today, he would have been either. Kyle Walker. Oh, Darun and Radebi. Walker looking for Chiro. Oh, lucky. Lays it off. Bench. Oh, he's at the post. Oh, my Lord. Oh, is it the double Herrera pivot? Have we got the double Herrera pivot from Manchester? Oh, what a tackle from Lucky Radebi. What? Okay, maybe not. Maybe he's going to get sent off. He might be being sent off. Oh boy, Pedri's playing as a striker now for the Weasels. Oh! Straight after the red card, the Weasels go up the pitch, get a corner, and score. Why is Ander <laughs> Why is Ander Herrera playing centre back? <laughs> they're they're down a goal, down a bounce. So like, right, what we need now, back three, and a DM. We don't have enough centre backs, so we'll play Ander Herrera at centre back. Luis Felipe will be the wide centre back. No, not Ander Herrera. We could have Ander Herrera as the wide centre back who could go forwards and get involved. <laughs> <laughs> what? Like, and Herrera will probably be a pretty good wide centre back. He's pretty good at getting involved up ar around the pitch. Much better than Luis Felipe, I have to imagine. Verratti? Off the bar. 
<laughs> They're just playing a more defensive version of the Weasels formation. Whilst down a goal and down a man. You love to see it. Victor Valdez, maybe not quite up to snuff tactically. But the Weasels get the win. Oh, it all started so well for the Ducks. Back to back losses though has us in the bottom half. Sad times. Messi no longer in the three best players in the league. It's over. The dream is dead. How did Ronnie miss that goal? That's a good question. He didn't even he didn't even get it on target. Not a good day in the office for Ronnie. Right, I'm going to love you and leave you. This was fun. Tomorrow we will be back with the heel. The community shield. Finally get the curtain raiser. Uh, and then another game week. So, be good. And, uh, toodaloo.